Hi, it's Kerr9000. Welcome back to my channel and welcome to one of my Never Grow Up Geek Culture Corner videos. Now, you've probably seen if you've watched the channel that I've done quite a lot of videos visiting arcades and going on arcade machines. The following thing I first saw as a prize in an arcade for, you know, quantum million tickets. But I've been looking for them in local shops and I was waiting for a specific one. We have got... Power Rangers Green Ranger Battle Bike. Now, Tommy Oliver, the Green Ranger, was my absolute favourite. And that is probably because the guy that played him, Jason David Frank, was absolutely amazing. Unfortunately, he's no longer with us, so I'll just say a quick RIP to the Green Ranger. But, you know, it will live on forever. Let's have a look. I mean, this is basically uh, Lego, not Lego, if you know what I mean. There's the bag of stuff. We've got some instructions. And we've got some stickers. Now, I don't want to send you to sleep watching me build it. So, uh, let's have a bit of Blue Peter magic here. There's your little Green Ranger. Something I don't really like though. Oh. Dude doesn't have a face. How hard would it have been to give him a face? So he's kind of stuck being the Ranger and can't be Tommy Oliver. Which is not great. The bike. Uh, we're getting there. Well, at the end of the day, with a lot of steering, here is my own battle bike. Probably notice it does not look like the one on the packaging, and that's because A, the instructions suck. They are not made anywhere near as good as Lego instructions, and just keep you wondering what the heck they actually mean. Maybe if I watched somebody on YouTube, I'd learn to build it. But B, it all falls apart so much easier than Lego. Now, I got this from a discount store for £2. So I'm not going to complain. And I'm happy with my little Tommy. Even if he's a faceless little Tommy. Yeah, it'll entertain kids. But if you actually want something to put on your shelf that's Power Rangers based, spend a few more quid. Get something else that it's all right, but if you want to knock around with a bit of fake Lego, fair enough. But it doesn't click together as good, and I just don't think it ever will be as good. That's uh, Kerr9000 saying thank you for watching my video. Take care of yourself and each other. Latest taters. Hi, it's Kerr9000, the Chrome Face Man. I'd just like to say thank you for making it to the end of my video. I've got lots of stuff on my channel. My horror house doing horror reviews, games room doing games, sci-fi station. It's absolutely chock-a-block full. I can also be found on the Retro Gamer U forum, which is full of great people, great laugh. At the end of this video, there's going to be some little icons to tick if you want to subscribe, a link to one video, a link to a playlist. I'd also like to recommend the wonderful, talented Just Jessica, who does cosy games like Dreamlight Valley, and is my supportive partner. Thank you ever so much, once again, for watching my video. And particularly if you follow me, thank you for all your support, and have a great rest of your day.